Hey guys, I visited three restaurants that I've seen on the Country Wayne Skit, and I'm so excited to show you where I went, how the food was, and just the overall great time that I had. So come on guys, let's see where I went. Okay y'all, so remember when um, Rico went to the bando and he joined in on prayer with that guy who was um, arresting um, Mr. Wong's daughter. So we're going to go in here and get some of the crack wings that the guy was eating when Rico um, joined in on his prayer. I not want to go to jail today, Father. But God, we ask and plead with you that you just see forgiveness in our heart. A nice, lovely meal here and see you. Bando's is a dope spot. This is right here. Hey guys, so if you ever Google the Bando, it's going to say the Bando Museum. Why? Because it features such great art from the 80s and the 90s. Such a cool spot to see. Okay guys, so we tried the Bando and um, I got some of this diabetes in a bottle. The Bando Punch. And it's supposed to make you feel like you was a kid. That's what they said on the video, right? Well, it does, and it makes me feel guilty as an adult mm. drinking this sweet behind drink. So, if you get this drink, plan on pouring half of it out and filling it up with water, because this is ridiculous. <laughs> Y'all think I've been looking for my, my blood pressure medicine? <laughs> I'm going to be needing something else for this. Mm. Were the wings all that they were hyped up to be? Well, I like them. Only thing is, I didn't know that there were different flavors and nobody told me. So, we just got like wings with the crack on it. What is the crack? I think it's uh, powdered sugar and parsley. And that's about it. But um, overall, it was a good experience. Um, the service was mediocre. And um, again, we didn't go for the service. I went for you guys. So, check out the bando. And maybe you'll see Rico. Bye, y'all. Hey y'all, so I just came to Paco Tacos, right? And guess who just left? Big dummy, Anthony. Anthony just left, y'all. I missed him by like a minute. So, uh, yeah, I don't know what he ordered. I should have asked, right? But anyway, Amber just left. We're about to try Paco Tacos. And if you don't remember what Paco Tacos was about, let's look at a clip from the skit. I mean, Dean, what's up? I thought you need to talk to me, but you got a couple of I don't even worry about that, man. Be my fault. You know, I ain't gonna do nothing dirty like that. Y'all, look at the cheese pool on this Bria taco. Crazy, right? Oh, I just had them Bria tacos from. Taco Taco. Them boys so hot, they got my glasses sideways. They got my glasses sideways, y'all. They got my nose running. My brother said, you can't taste nothing but the chili peppers. All of us nose are running. Y'all, mama likes spicy stuff and she's scared to eat it. <laughs> Y'all, she, she's scared to eat it after what happened to me. My glass is sideways. She said, I, ain't, I can't do it. She said she can't do it, y'all. That chicken nacho was really good. Everything was good. I mean, you see the cheese on the burrito. It was good. Everything was just good. They make their own chips and everything, so perfect. <laughs> Perfect meal combination. Um, if you're over here in Atlanta, mm -hmm. you're in Bankhead, go to Paco Taco. Mm. This right here, Jay. These snow cones are the bomb. It was good. I I've heard about mm. the, the New Orleans snow cone. I never had one. Mm. This really tastes like cheesecake. I told you, the best one in Atlanta. Mm. But Jay, listen, mm -hmm. I want to thank you for meeting me. Oh, for sure. I have been dealing with some things that I kind of needed a male perspective on. The mural was so colorful, guys. So beautiful. Okay, y'all. So we finally finished the slushy thing that we had at Nola's Cafe. She was bleeding like a cycle of menstrual on her second day. <laughs> we had to pour it out into 
little bowls and stuff just to get a handle of that run. But uh, overall, it was really good. They gave my mother a free slice of cake, as you can see right here, for her birthday. Service was real good. And so out of Paco Taco, uh, the Banjo, and uh, Nola Cafe, I, I would say the service overall was really good. I'd give it a 9 out of 10. Although the Banjo Bando need a little bit of help. But, um, <laughs> when it comes to service, but, um, you know, some places you go to, you're really not going there for service. But overall, we had a really nice time. Now, um, we got here on Thursday and I meant to do some of my visits on Thursday and the rest on Friday and go to the comedy show. Well, that did not happen because we didn't get here until like 9 o'clock Thursday night. Everything was closed, so we had to try to do everything today and celebrate my mother's birthday at the same time. So we did not make the comedy show, but I do have my tickets for Charlotte because I'm not going to be in Washington for um, 420 weekend. So um, I will still get a chance to see Wayne. I just did not get to see him in um, Atlanta. But we did visit some of the shout outs. So uh, overall, everything was good, guys. We just needed a little bit more seasoning on the food. But hey, I had a really nice time. And I can't wait to visit the other places or the other shout outs that I have seen before. So guys, let me know if you have visited any of these places. And let me know, guys, if you made it to see Country Wayne while he was in Atlanta. Bye, y'all. If you haven't, please make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification, guys, so you'll know when I upload a video. As always, guys, I'm going to see you in the next one. Bye.